In this video, I will show you how to install Haskell in Ubuntu on WSL, Windows Subsystem for Linux. Haskell is a programming language that assembles programs around functions. For an overview and grammar of Haskell, please refer to reference of narration and reference file. First, open Ubuntu on WSL. First, type sudo apt update to get updated information. Next, type sudo apt upgrade and update the system. First, from the command line, type cd slash mnt slash c to go to the Windows C drive. Next, type ls and display the contents of the C drive. It's OK. Next, create a directory of for Haskell in a specific directory. Here, I created a directory named Haskell. Under and the score score my PRG directory. Next, we are going to install Haskell. Type sudo apt install Haskell platform. Since installation is already finished here, it will end immediately, but it will take some time to install a new one. Next, we are going to install Stack. Stack is a tool to create a new Haskell projects and build them. Type sudo apt install Haskell Stack. Since installation is already finished here, it will end immediately, but it will take some time to install a new one. Next, we are going to prepare the environment of the editor for editing Haskell's program. Start Visual Studio Code by typing code dot on the command line. First, click the extension icon on the left and type Haskell in the search box. Then, Haskell syntax highlighting will be displayed in the search result, so click install. When the explanation page of Haskell syntax highlighting is displayed, click Reload and activate to activate it. Next, change the setting so that bash can be used in the timer window. Enter control comma to display the setting page. Then type timenow.integrated in the search box. Then click on ed edit settings.json. Then the contents of the user setting will be displayed on the right side. Type terminal.integrated.shell.windows column c colon windows sysnative bash dot exe. Then save this file and exit the VS Code once. Return to the command line and the type dot code dot to restart the VS Code. When the VS Code opens, use the Ctrl plus back apostrophe key to open the timer window. 
you can see that bash is enabled. Next, create a simple Haskell program and check startup. With VS Code, create a new file called hello.hs file. And type main equal put strln hello world. Save this file. Then, in the terminal window, type ghc hello.hs dash o hello o3. GHC is a compiler and hello o3 is the name of executable file generated by compilation. We are going to execute this file. Type dot slash hello o3. You will find hello world. It's okay. Next, execute Haskell file without specifying an output file. Then, run gsc hello.hs. Hello world has been output. It's okay. We are able to confirm the installation of Haskell. Thank you for your watching.